Hey you guys, I'm coming to give you a quick update um, on where I'm at. Um, I am now in my two week week. Um, so, I actually got my positive OPK on cycle day 13, um, which I took that as like 13, 14, 15, and like 16, those are going to be the days that I baby dance or whatever. So we, um, we use this, this month. I hope you can see it. It's the pre-seed. Um, as you can see, it's gone. <laughs> I've I've used this probably. I used it a couple cycles. We don't use a lot because I, we don't need a lot, but we do we do use this to see if it will help. Um, yeah, for for a couple months now, and it's pretty much gone. And it was like twenty dollars. So, it was pretty expensive, but if you guys don't use this, I would say go use it. Um, try it out, see if you like it. It's okay. Um, I'm not pregnant yet, so, but it's supposed to help, and it's supposed to be safe for when you're trying to conceive. So, the pre-seed is it's cool. It's okay. Um, um, where else am I? Oh, okay, so I wanted to tell you guys. Um, in my first video, I told you that I was taking the Chinese fertility um, tea. So this month, I did not get any CM, which was very odd for me. I've been tracking, so every month I get my cervical mucus, the really clear, you know, clear, sticky kind. And this month, I didn't get it. So, I don't know if it's because of the tea, if the tea that I'm drinking dried up my CM. I don't know. I didn't get it at all. I was looking for it. I'm like, okay, is it coming? Is it coming? It never came. And then, um, today, I got the white CM. So, I thought, I thought that was weird that I didn't get the clear CM, but I got the white CM. And I already ovulated, like, four days ago, so... I don't, I don't really know what's going on. It could be the tea. It could not be the tea. It could just be my body. Um, I know I need this, the CM for, um, for the sperm to swim better, but I don't know what's going on. So, that's that. Um, that was really weird. And then, um, that's pretty much, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk to you guys about excuse me, was about the no, the no cervical mucus, not knowing if it's because of the fertility tea that I'm taking. Um, but it was weird to not have any, but to have the white cervical mucus, I've stopped drinking the tea. Um, just because I'm no longer waiting to ovulate, I already ovulated. So if the tea was going to do anything, I felt like it would have done it before ovulation. So, um, the next batch of tea that I'm supposed to be taking, it's a different kind of tea. I haven't gotten it yet. When I get it, I'll let you guys know. And it's a tea that you take while you're on your menstrual cycle. Um, and then you go back to this other tea that I already showed you that you take while you're not on. Um, so I'm not taking the tea anymore just because I feel like if it was going to benefit me, it would have done it before I ovulated. Now that I already ovulated, the, taking the tea is kind of... I don't, I don't know. Maybe I should still take it. I don't know, but I'm not. Um, and that's pretty much it. You know, the pre-seed is cool. We baby danced a couple days before ovulation and ovulation day. I did not baby dance after ovulation because I was tired of baby dancing. <laughs> um, so no, no baby dancing after ovulation. Um, we did wait like a day in between. Um, you know, we wasn't baby dancing every single day. It was like a day in between. And then we baby danced like pretty much every other day. That's what I'm going to say. And, um, that's pretty much it. I'll let you guys know, um, what else is going on. I'm only for DPO today. So I'm probably not going to come back with another video for another five or six days or something when I will be anxious out of my pants to... You know, P-O-A-S. 
So I'll let you guys know what happens this month. Maybe the no CM means something. I don't know. I'll let you guys know. Bye.